from a point on the ground the angles of elevation of the bottom and the top of a, a transmission tower fixed at the top of a 20 meter high building are 45 degree and 60 degree respectively find the height of the tower see here understand this question from a point on the ground now p is the point of observation from a point on the ground the angles of elevation of the bottom and the top of a transmission tower fixed at the top of a 20 meter high building now tower fixed at the top of building this is building and is the tower observe here bc is the tower fixed at the top of 20 meter high building ab is the building height of the building is 20 meter tower fixed at the top of a building now the angles of elevation of the bottom and top of a tower first angle of elevation of bottom that is from P to B we have to draw a line PB is the line of sight and angle of elevation is 45 degree and to the top the angle of elevation is 60 degree from point P the angle of elevation of bottom is 45 degree and angle of elevation of the top is 60 degree now see here this angle is 45 degree and this angle is 60 degree angle of elevation is always measured with the horizontal now find the height of the tower here tower is BC so height of the tower is distance BC let the distance BC is equal to X let the distance PA is equal to Y that is distance of point P from the building take it as Y now we have to find the value of X that is the height of the tower Now tan 45 degree is equal to tan 45 degree is equal to observe the triangle tan 45. We have to observe triangle P B A. Observe triangle P B A. Opposite side is A B. Adjacent side is P A. In triangle B P A angle P is 45 degrees so opposite side is A B adjacent side is P A so A B is 20 meter P A is Y tan 45 degree is equal to opposite by adjacent tan value of tan 45 degree is 1 is equal to opposite side is 20 meter adjacent side is Y if you cross multiply then 1 into y is y is equal to 20 we got the value of y now tan 60 degree to write tan 60 degree we have to concentrate on the triangle c p a because CPA is a right triangle and angle CPA is 60 degree. So opposite side of angle CPA is C and adjacent side is 
CPA. See here, angle CPA is 60 degree. So opposite side is CA, adjacent side is PA. CA is equal to X plus 20 and adjacent side is Y. Value of tan 60 degree is root 3. Opposite side is x plus 20 by adjacent is y. Now root 3 is equal to x plus 20 by y. y. Value of y we know. That is y is equal to 20. Now if you cross multiply, then 20 root 3 is equal to x plus 20. Now move 20 to the left hand side that becomes x is equal to 20 root 3 minus 20. Now here 20 is common so take it outside. So inside the bracket root 3 minus 1. Therefore height of the tower is equal to Twenty into root three minus one meter. Height of the tower is x. See here. Height of the tower is x. Therefore, we got the value of x is twenty into root three minus one. Therefore, height of the tower is 20 into root 3 minus 1 meter.